Welcome back to No Man's Sky, everyone. So, I got a little bit done between the last episode and now. I built a shack, which was where I placed our um, refiner, and then we built a blueprint analyzer, and this was all after I placed down one of these thingies to make a habitable, habitable base. <laughs> Um, so, I kind of chose an area where you can see water, and you can see the rings of the planet, and the clouds and all that. Because, at some point, we're going to be making a mobile base on a freighter, but for now, this will do. Um, I also decided to grind up a little bit and build our first decent-sized room, and we built a construction terminal, but we don't have anyone manning it yet, so... Stuff for us to do! Um, but we're in a Corvax system, so I don't think we're going to be able to get someone from this galaxy. So let's just quickly... Yeah, let's investigate the signal instead. Constantly running out of fucking launch fuel. It'll be better later when I've got some of the fuel that it requires that isn't just launch fuel. Um, what is it again? Uranium, I think it is. Either way, we've got a proper base now, so that's good. The first thing I'll want to buy with nanite clusters when I've got enough is an advanced mining um, thingy, so we can mine for some better minerals without having to refine. Because that shit's annoying. This is actually a really pretty galaxy. I'll have to land on all of these planets and name them all. I named the one I'm currently on as our home base, um, Delogany which is named after a city in Breath of Fire 2. I'll probably theme a lot of planets off video game towns or something like that, so I don't know. Some RPG nerd might come across them and be like, Hey! I know that place. I get references. I don't know. But, in this episode, we should get a new ship anyway, because it's kind of part of the story to get a slightly better ship. I do kind of like this little thing, but it's really lacking in the storage space department. And buying a ship costs fucking millions, like, way too fucking much. And now they've taken out the, um, way of locking on or targeting crashed ships, so it's a lot harder to farm for a ship now as well. Alright, who are we going to talk to? Find life forms and ask about the emergency signal. That's technically a life signal, or a life form. Kovax, Traveler. Repeat the code. Huh. What about you, buddy? Oh, what about you, green friend? We are watching you, traveler friend. What we have left. No, find what we have left you. And coordinates. Sweet. Hmm, the first other ship I've seen. And it's a piece of shit. I like my fighter class ships. I really hope they um add in a shipbuilding thing later on. Cause that would just be fucking awesome. I'd make 
I'd probably make an R wing from Star Fox, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> or something similar. I don't know, I want maximum slots and maximum fighting ability. Maneuverability. Speed and attack. Don't have to worry about defense as much if you don't get hit and your enemies die before they can hit you. I like the little, um, the boosters on this. Shooting out purple slipstreams. A blighted planet. Yay. Although that is good to have in the system, I guess. Oh, that's the planet we started on. Okay, fair enough. I do like what they've done with the clouds. It's like there's two layers of clouds. There's the upper atmosphere and the lower atmosphere. And if you're in the upper atmosphere on a planet, you can still... Um, what are they called again? You can still use your pulse engine. Oh dear. It's a crashed freighter. Well, this would be Salvage City. Like, literally enough to build a city out of. Signal has led me to the wreck of a freighter. Colossal fragments of metal scattered across the landscape. Were these messages nothing but the misfiring circuits of a long forgotten ruin? Nestled among the debris, I find the pilot's log blinking, awaiting input. Instead of displaying the ship's log, the terminal split spits out a strange sequence of numbers. They are followed by a short message. The anomaly comes for the stars. Take flight. A schematic for the hyperdrive is attached at the end of the message. Sweet! Chromatic metal, do not have enough. Because of course I fucking don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I've got no navigation data. And let me guess. Yep, gotta build more fucking fuel. Holy shit. <sighs> Gotta be fucking kidding me. Refueling that thing is the biggest fucking bitch. I can't wait until I've got a half decent ship with amount with a decent amount of slots. Um where's some fucking ferrite? Ah, oh, that's some. Look at those fucking lurching horrors. Would you fuck off? Go on, get! Go away! I only need enough for one more. Oops. Um, how much do I need? Suck shit. I got what I need. I'm the fuck out of here. Apparently if you click on the things in the bottom right corner, dihydrin or stuff like that, you can actually set up like a mini submission on where to find those sorts of things. Um, let's just have a look at that. So I might as well dole out some tips that I've picked up along the way. Um, Log. Find and construct launch fuel. So, it tells us to make metal plating. A refiner may be required. That sort of shit. Oh. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. You get in there. Let's get the fuck out of here. Fuck this forsaken rock.
that's home. Man, that's fucking cool. Okay, so I need two more of these. And a bunch more chromatic metal, which comes from copper. We might be able to buy either. We have fuck all. Oh man. <sighs> Probably gonna have to sell some shit. It's alright, we'll figure it out. Maybe I can farm up a little bit of money on the way. Gimme gold! That's good too, but I'd prefer the gold. Silver's good. It's almost as good as gold. I'd really love it if they stuck in um, Star Fox style bosses. Like as random community events and stuff like that. That would be fucking amazing. almost all the patience I have. Fuck it. Oh. Might as well grab these close ones. Don't you know what the fuck I was aiming at there. I really, really wanted No Man's Sky to succeed, like... I know some people out there are salty, and as I've said, I'm not really going to address too much of that controversy, but, um... Let's face it, we've got, like, a, a game where you can blast off from a planet and fly out of orbit, fly across a star system, and land on another fucking planet and there's no loading screens you just fly off like I assume there's like procedural loading but it's hidden well enough that it's not too much of a bother I guess like some things load as you get closer to them that sort of thing but it's really not bad it's Pretty well done, admittedly. I don't know. After all of that, all they've added for free, I think there's a bit of credit where credit's due. They've done fairly well. That Corvex casing can fuck off. That projectile ammunition can fuck off. This shit can fuck off too. What have I got that's even worth anything? Oops. Here we go. Silver, buy silver. Um, gold, yeah, you can go too. Oh, I still need a little bit more. I'm not selling those microprocessors. I need that shit. Oh, my chromatic metal. No, I need that so bad. Um, oh, man. I really hope that doesn't come to bite me in the ass. 
Um, there they are. Let's see how many I needed. Um, what is it? Yep, five, cool. So I didn't even need to sell my fucking oxygen. I wish there was a buyback function, that would be nice. What have they got that I might need though? Unstable plasma, ferrite dust. That's a lot of ferrite dust. Cobalt. We're gonna need a fair bit of that. I'll buy, I don't know, a hundred. Oxygen. I'll buy a hundred or so of that as well, just to keep us going. Selling copper. Oh, yes. Okay, now we're poor again. Really poor. I'm going to head back to base because we can refine that copper into chromatic is that what it's called? chromatic we oh, metal, there it is in the corner man that is not bad placement for a base either just hook a, hook a right as soon as you leave the, sp the station and off you go should probably land on that moon so I can name it as well. So yeah, my mission in landing here will be to refine some chromatic metal and some cobalt into ionized cobalt. I don't know if I need to do that or not. It's either cobalt or ionized cobalt, because then we can build a portal at our base. Ah, oh, fuck. I think we farmed up a whole bunch of that. Um, and I should be able to build the advanced mining laser as well. So we'll be building our... You go there. We'll be building our hyperdrive. We'll be building in the last slot. Oh fuck, I don't even have enough nanite clusters. Might do a little bit of nanite cluster farming. I don't know. I guess it doesn't really matter, I can buy it from any base, it's just I'd like to have the stuff on me so as soon as I can afford the blueprint, I can make it. Because then things like pure ferrite and um, the bigger stacks of... Fuck, what's it called again? Crystallized carbonite? I don't fucking know. The big crystals. <laughs> Either way. Yeah, I'll be able to farm all of those. I would have preferred to have had a headquarters that had like trees and shit around, but I don't think trees and stuff grow in these higher up places on this particular planet, which is a bit of a bummer, but they do have... I know it's not loaded yet, but they do have a whole bunch of crystals and flowers and stuff, so... As you can see there, and then there's some of the big crystals we'll be able to farm in a bit. And then there's the rings. You can see a planet in the distance. We can see water down there. And that water down there has some stuff we'll need later on as well. So, where the fuck am I going? <laughs> Always fucking around. Make some more chromatic metal. Where is the copper? Let's chuck in some more carbon. Wow. Okay, well that's doing its thing. I might run up here and grab some crystallized carbon. Because we're about to run out of the ability to shoot stuff. I'm 
I'm probably going to have to remake the advanced mining laser and everything a whole bunch more times as soon as I get a better, um... Fuck. Fuck. As soon as I get a better multi-tool, but... We're just going for what helps us out the most at the moment. Oxygen, come on man, where's the rest of the Where's the good crystals? Where's that good crystal? <laughs> I might be a little bit too realistic in how long I can run. So yeah, I did cut out a fair, fair chunk of all of the farming, like, there was a lot. Um, I guess we don't need the carbon right now, but... Would have been nice. That, um, chromatic metal is probably nearly done, so I'm just gonna head back. Yeah, this is a nice high up place where we can get a nice vantage of the planet itself. See a planet there. Can we see any more planets? Not at the moment. Oh well. Having one in the middle of the sky is pretty awesome. Or is that the moon? It's probably the moon. This is what happens when you skip leg day. Or when you only do leg day. Come on, bitch, run! I don't know if I'll keep my little shack. I kinda like it. It's Willy's shack! Either way, we need that hyperdrive built as soon as possible. And then we'll continue on with the quest line for that. Yeah, it's done. It's done. Sweet. Oh cool, I actually have lights on my ship now. So much more detail than there used to be. And there's our hyperdrive. Now we need to find antimatter. Follow the signal and locate a source of antimatter. Okay, this we can do. I'm gonna have to make more of that fucking fuel. <laughs> Bane of my fucking existence. Um. Sweet. Where the fuck is that? Ah. Actually, where's that moon? Where's our base? There's our base. Our base overlooks that way. Ah, eh, fuck it, I'll come back for that sort of shit. Um. Now I've lost the fucking thing. Oh, okay, here we go. Anomalous broadcast. Too close to the planet, apparently. Guess we get to land on the moon after all.
That's some sideways shit. Cactus moon, huh? Moistulous, low sentinels, ample flora, and high fauna. Hmm. Wow, this place has probably seen better days. Take whatever you've got. Because free shit is awesome. Oh, get out of here, you filthy tentacle motherfucker. Yeah, we'll get rid of that residual goop. Clogged with an unnerving, pulsating slime, nevertheless it appears to function. As I touch the input panel, the alien substance reacts violently. Make a note to avoid getting closer. The device opens, revealing a single unblinking crimson eye. It deposits a sample of antimatter accompanied by a strange message. Read the log. You will find us when the time is right. 16, 16, 16, 16. Antimatter housing. Okay. Craft a warp cell. I need ferrite dust. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, cool. Craft housing. Craft a warp cell. Make sure the quest load catches up. Fuel the hyperdrive. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Gotta fucking farm more ferrite. And make more fucking launch fuel. I know it gets better later, it does. This has a fucking real bad plague of luck when it comes to this shit. Always runs out when I need it. Craft one. Craft two. That. Craft that. Oh, you know what? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do something smart. Ish. Smart ish. Um, this. Okay, is that enough to craft another one? I think it is. Okay, we'll keep that fuel for when we fucking need to escape somewhere. Okay. So since we're getting the fuck out of here... Let's enter that galaxy map. I don't want a Corvax map. Uh, what's this one? A Corvax, a Viking. I kind of want a Gek system. That one. Four planets. Nice. Planetary outpost, eh? Oh, you gotta be kidding me.
thanks. Planet Uranus Omega. Oh, here come some other ships. Wonder if these are any good. This one looks like it might be a fighter. Ah, it's Prut here. Oh my god, I love him. Gives me a blueprint. Sweet. Antimatter blueprint. You don't scare me at all. What's shaking, trade on boy? Oh fuck! What happened to your face? <laughs> Sorry, that was rude. But um, bye. Um. Oh, butter. Yeah, relic. Sell that for ten times as much. if I can be super lazy here. I will sell the Gek Relic for 23 times as much as I bought it for. And then buy... Oh, it's fuck all ferrite dust. Damn it. It was a good idea. It just didn't pan out the way I wanted it to. And just buy Iron Ice Cobalt and Platinum. All right. Um. Oh, I like free stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not full out yet. How much do I need to build a housing? Ah, oh, yes, I can build it. There's another warp cell. Fill this bitch up. So I gotta run across and jump back up. Ooh, only just. Oh, <laughs> close. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, that was terrible. Let's not let that happen again. That could have been the end of us right there. Make our way into space. Where do these motherfuckers want us to go? Actually, before I do this, I'm just gonna switch. Expand my base. Hmm. Free ex 
explore black hole atlas station. Really? Huh. Oops. There we go. Viking. We'll have a Gek, a Viking, and a Corvax. Starship monitoring system reports hyperdrive error warp fuel depleted. come to this galaxy to do a little bit of farming later and try and get a better multi-tool. Because all the races kind of specialize, so you've got your Corvax, which are like suit upgrades, your Gek, which are, I'm pretty sure they're the ones that do the ship upgrades, and then there's the Viking, which do all of your gun upgrades. Wait, where am I going? Oh, are you fucking kidding me? <sighs> Alright. Thought I had to come in here. Apparently not. I'd love to see this game combined with maybe like Mass Effect 2 and maybe or or even Destiny even <laughs> like have your FPS elements and then combine that with fucking Subnautica and Raft to make the ultimate survival game and then combine it again with Star Fox. So you've just got all of the elements there. Submersible, on water, on land, FPS, competitive, um, jeez, I guess you'd call it shoot 'em ups I guess Star Fox would technically be classified as. Broiling humidity, yay! You better pry into other people's business. What a silly name for a planet. Stone resonates. Yep, yep, yep. I will accept the knowledge. Give me the knowledge. Interloper. Alright, what do we got here? structure is unlike anything I've encountered on my journey so far. Uh, everything is about everything about it is so obviously alien, so obviously out of place. As I stare at it, words from words form themselves in my mind. A strange fragment of a broken stretch. Is it traveller? Is it friend? Let's be friend. Is it first or is it last? First. Has it seen the Crimson Eye? Or has the Crimson Eye seen it? I'm gonna go with both. Although I feel like it's a lie, but I feel like they all would have been lies. Ooh. Where did I pop? 
talk my fucking shit. Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, I'm boiling alive in here. Find the mysterious messenger. Make your way into space. I will! There are strange powers at work. I've been left messengers, crumbs that lead me along a trail. Should I seek answers? Should I investigate? Yes, search for answers. Obviously. Mission target is in another galaxy. Oops, no. That's not the right one. This is the right one. Oh, hi. Check out this dude. 16. The panels and systems idle. Nada stares at them, their mask waning. A single word issuing from their mask, their refrain. 16. Transmit milestone data. Data. You have seen much. Please take this. Only 400. Ah, that's enough for our mining laser at least. Friends everywhere, of all sizes. Find data for Polo. <laughs> Ooh. Ken has? Oh, yeah, for two million dollars. Fuck. Oh man, looks awesome. I want it. that I need to meet a whole bunch of aliens. That's okay. Let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, so since we've got more hyperdrive fuel... Matter, make housing, make warp cell. In you go. Alright, where do we want to go? Up here, maybe? Or is this Corvax? Nah. We want to go and find ourselves a nice little GEC system. Let's do this one. Ooh, lots of planets.
Jeez, I hope I didn't do something stupid by starting this fight. We're gonna rescue this freighter. down. Ah oh, shit, here we fucking go. close. There goes another one. Oh shit. Nice. Who did we save? Did we save these? Is it? it is them. Cool. Five of many in the future, I'm sure. Huh. Freighters have a different layout now. They absolutely do. I guess that's for building your base on here. That's awesome. Hey buddy. He's like, what's up? Interloper. Blah 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 blah. The alien box. A loud battle cry as I approach. Celebrating our victory, I hope. They gesture towards the control panel of the freighter, as if to suggest I take command. Ooh. This is mine now. This giant fucking corkscrew. That's awesome. Um, yes, except Jesus. All I call it. Um, we'll go with the S A X Yggdrasil, and S A X is both a nod to Metroid Fusion and Shade Orion, and then X. I will call this the gun. <laughs> and I'll call this the S A X Meep. Um, I don't want to look at the warp drive. I want to look at. Hey, buddy, what's up? Oh, he wants me to make a thing. Oh, man, making a thing. I can't make a thing, I don't have enough things. 
That's alright. We'll do that shit in the next episode. The point is that we've got a fucking freighter now. That's insane. I was not expecting to get one that early. That's great, though. It means we've got a mobile base. Um... Okay, so I need to meet more aliens and stuff for that anyway. That's alright. Well, I might call this an episode here anyway. Actually, I'll call it an episode in a moment, because I've got a freighter that I'm going to go land on. Because then you... Apparently you can have an entire fleet now, not just the freighter, you can get frigates and stuff, is what I meant to say, not freighter. Um, I believe that's my frigate right there, and it looks awesome. You can buy extra ones off other freighters as well. I'm pleased to report local trade scouts have secured favourable deals across the system. I will collect the units, thank you. Cool. So yeah. I guess you send them off on little missions and they bring you back resources and money, which is great. That's fucking awesome. Imagine how great it'll be when I've got like 10 of these motherfuckers working for me. Anyway, I'm going to call out an episode there, guys. If you like what you saw, like, comment, and subscribe. It helps us out a lot. And we'll see you in the next episode of No Man's Sky next. Thanks for watching, everyone.